channel and I hope you guys are doing absolutely fine. So first of all, just simply log in with your credentials and once you're done with that, in the description box of this video, I will share on GitHub link. Just simply click on that link and then you are able to access this file. Now just me scroll down and from where you can see this URL. So just simply open this URL in incognito window. This will activate the cloud shell. Meantime, just me come back over here and from where you can see this curl command. This will download this GitHub repo from my GitHub to your cloud shell. Then we have to make this file executable. For that, we have to just me run this chmod command. And for executing all the command, we have to just me run this last command over here. So just me copy all these commands, come back, paste, hit enter. Wait for a second and then just me click on this authorize button over here. Now just me wait for this command get execute and once it's done, we will move forward with the next part of this lab. And it's finally done. Okay, now what you do? Just me come back over here and from where you can see this workstation you are. Just me open this link in incognito window, like this way. Come back over here. Now just me click on the start button. Now just me wait for this instance get started. And it's finally done. Now just me click on this launch button over here. Now just me click on this files, then just me click on this terminal and then just me click on this new terminal over here. Now come back over here, just me copy this command. Okay, so this is a task number two command. Just me paste over here. Okay, click on this allow. And if you are not able to paste the command, just me right click and paste. Okay, now hit enter button. Now what you do, you have to just me enter your project ID. So just me come back to the lab instructions. From here, just me copy your project ID, paste over here, hit enter. Wait for a second. Now just me hit command button, or if you are using a Mac, so just me press control button, and then just me click on this link. Click on this open. Now you have to just me authorize yourself like this way from here just me copy this token come back paste hit enter now you have to just me wait for this command get execute and once it's done you are done with this lab so just me wait for a couple of seconds and after that we will check the score for the lab
and is finally done. Now if you just simply come back over here and click on the check my progress for each and every task, you will get a score without any issue. And if the score is not updated for any particular task, no need to worry. Just simply wait for a couple of seconds and you will get a full score over here for sure. So just simply wait and watch. And as you can see, it's done. And that's the way we have to complete this lab. If you still have any doubts, please do let me in the comment section. Thanks for watching and have a good day guys.